I miss you, Mom. I miss you, Mom. <laughs> what is up, people? We're going to be doing a little vlog today. Um, we got to do a vlog today. A what? A vlog today. Just a little vlog of yeah, um, and the a day in a life of pretty much what we get up to. First off, I'm just gonna go drop these little ones off to their daycare. Um, and it's school holiday still, so my eldest is still at home. And my youngest. Hi. Ira, jump in. Everyone jump in. Um, but we got two jobs to sort out. Uh, one at home and there's gonna be one call out job. What was that, Vale? Okay, good girl. All right. Are you gonna have a good day at uh, daycare today? Yes. And my friends are gonna be playing with me. Uh -huh. Your friends are playing with you? Yeah. yeah. And my friends are going to my friends that I see on my way in the toilet and I just hugged her. You see a way in the toilet and you hugged her? Yeah. <laughs> That's the one. Go girls. Dad, do that, dad. Dad. I think it's been like two months since the little one's been at daycare, but it gets easier and easier, you know. In the beginning, I was like just being a mean so gay, but. Thank you. Drop them off, lay the bolt. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're on our way home now. Our first job's already there. The car got dropped off last night, and it's just going to be a minor service. And also, double check a oil leak that's going on. So, he's been saying that um, there's some oil stains or, yeah, some oil leaks on his uh, driveway. So, we're going to go ahead and check that out. Um, see what's going on there after that we're going to be driving out to i think it was sunnybank the last time i went to his house i can't remember exactly where but um we're going to be doing a starter murder on a kia carnival so so uh yeah come with me mosos let's go all right there it is what is this camry Shaky. All right, so minor service. We got air filter, engine flush, oil filter, and most importantly, the engine oil. So first off, we're gonna start off with the flush, um, let the car run for 10, 15 minutes, shut it off, change the air filter, drop the oil and the oil filter, fill it up, and then check all the other fluids and other little checks as well. While the car is running, um, if the air filter is easy enough to get to, I'll just go ahead and change it while the engine is running. So here, two tabs, lift, that's your air filter. That's your air filter right there. Right. Look at that. Okay, so we done air filter, we put in the engine flush. Engine is uh, running right now, 10, 15 minutes. So we've got about 10 minutes left. What I'm gonna do next is jack up the car so it's ready in position for us to drain the oil and remove the oil filter. So yeah, it's one of those things. You always gotta try and think ahead. Um, you know, you've got 10 minutes of engine running, doing its thing with the engine flush 
so is there anything else I can do in between type of thing just to save you time um, but yeah we're just gonna get it up on some stands jack it up and as soon as, as that's done we can drop the floor straight away play this game right trying to guess the size of the drain bolt so most of them are 17s so we're gonna go down with a 17 hopefully we don't have to come back up here because we need a, a different number but um, I'm pretty sure 17 surely because you see the goal is you go under there get the job done you don't have to come back here because you need something else so we're going to take our little claw tool for the air filter. I mean, sorry, the oil filter. We're going to take a rag. It is going to be a little bit messy under there. Um, what else do we need? I can't even see my claw tool. Claw tool, like something like this with the extension 3 8 And then you got, you know, your little belt handle type. Um, but depending on which way the oil filter is facing will be the easiest tool for it. So I, can't, I still can't find my claw tool. So I think we're just going to go crack the drain bolt then come back up. All right, here goes nothing. And that does not look like a 17. <sighs> See, that's what I mean, guys. By now the oil would have been draining but I'm here looking for another size okay let's try what, what do you reckon 15 let's try 15 yep. oh, shit yep 14 that is get our pen ready see that a little bit of mess but that's why you gotta have a rag oil's drained and now we got to get our cartridge filter tool so that's what it looks like let me grab the tool all right guys so as you can see the oil cap or the oil filter housing for the cartridge filter is removed and that's it there <laughs> so when i removed it 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 broke and then it started leaking so we're gonna need to replace that as well as the oil filter and clean up all this mess so yeah just another day another day of uh mucking around with cars now i'm just trying to look for one so yeah it's just a part of um you know with cars sometimes an easy job can turn into a bit of a disaster but um i caught around and no one's got it but i think cooper's planes uh, Ripco Max have one in stock, so we're gonna go drive down to Cooper's Plains, probably have a feed, and then um, finish this one off so we can go to our next job. Oh my gosh, now. Ended up coming to uh, Richlands because it was closer and they got a they got stock as well. So. There it is. Yep, there we go. Get on now. Hi, uh, can I get a um Thank you. Thank you so much. Alright, cheers. Oh. Oh. So full, man. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> 
We're about 25 minutes away from home, so we're gonna shoot off home and um, and then go finish this job. Maybe not. Are you happy? In you go, buddy. In you go. On this one, oil up the threads and the O ring you can see there too. Because, yeah, it just goes in nice and easy. Well, are you happy now? Last but not least, we've got to fill her up. And there's a app on, um, if you look up on Google, Regio to Oil, it'll tell you how many liters your car takes. So that's a good app just to have uh, in handy. What a mission, bro. <laughs> and that was only the first job. We're now gonna get ready to um, just double check. We got all the tools on the ute and then probably have a little rest and then head off to my next one. So the time is 2.46 and I think we got all the tools we need but I'm just gonna double check so I'll go double check in case I forget something and then we'll shoot off there. All right I forgot where we're going but I'll see you when we get there. guys we just made it to eight miles plains and I'm gonna put on this bad boy right, let's see what happens Why want you walk? Mm. yeah that's just like a sea starter eh? all right is it true if um, all your legs from the car it will explode? Colin, what are you doing down I don't here? Know. <laughs> all right, guys, we'll have a look up here, right in the front of the engine. You can see the starter motor buried down there. I had to take the cover off. Um, what's <laughs> up? Had to take the cover off. Now sort of exposes parts of the starter motor but what I'm looking at now is I'm trying to find a spot to take it off because I know for certain it's not going to fit in this gap or this gap here so we might have to remove the engine mount in the front here uh, remove the engine mount and the engine mount bracket and maybe we'll have enough space to pull the starter motor out and there you have it, guys. See, so you were right. That's what I was gonna say. <laughs> start a meta? Huh? Start a meta? Oh. Start a meta, not meta. That's the one, mate. So apparently, you don't have to um, remove anything. So pretty much, where it came through was right in between the engine mount bracket and the O2 sensor. So right in this gap here, um, and. And then around here, so yeah, that's the way we're gonna pull it back up. So let's go. Now, now you are okay. 
All right, guys, we are about to throw in the starter motor on this V6 Kia Carnival. Um, basically, this one was pretty much seized up. You can tell from the teeth on this thing. Yeah. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and throw it up. Well, what was your name again, um, cameraman? What was your name? Uh, yeah. What was your name? <laughs> Leka Eli. Oh, this is Leka Eli at the back. <laughs> you don't think he's doing a good job? Oh, yeah. You, we got to see hands on action, eh? Go up. I'll go up. Hands on action. You need to show them what I'm not just open his elbow. Solid shut up! No, E, go further in and true, true. What is this? Yeah, like that. That's the one. What is See? this? That's a starter motor. Ooh, I want that too. Starter motor right there. A starter motor. Yeah, starter motor. Oh, I got black hands. So I put it down. So I put it down. I got black hands in it. That's why you call this guy to come. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? You guys are all gonna come back for me, eh? Yo, yeah, sure. Yo, yeah, I'll, I'll be a recorder guy. Yeah? You'll be a cameraman. Okay, I like that. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, you can see right there we've got a brand new starter motor mounted. Um, I'm gonna test it first before I put the covers on. So we're gonna go and flip the key on and uh, see what happens. Alright. Yeah. Moment of moment of truth, buddy. Where it doesn't twist. Oh yep. Yeah. Okay, we got power. You wanna do a countdown? Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, we need a we need more battery. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> All right, we got the new battery in. Let's start it. Tell her you're the man, bro. <laughs> All right, guys, and that is it for today. Thanks for tuning in and watching this vlog. Um, pretty much what some of my days look like here and there just one of the many few days that i might post but if you guys like this vlog then please um let me know oh but anyways i gotta go have a shower wash my hands and i'm just gonna go and chill with the kids so seki until next time thanks for watching and do it those away let's go